Well, hey guys, and welcome back to Hey, It's a Good Life. I'm so glad you're here because today I want to tell you a story. Today, I want to tell you the story of our first ever garden party. This garden party has been about six months in the making. I've got all my garden helpers out here today helping us continue the succession sowing and get ready for our first ever party out here with our friends. We've got seeds to sow and a party to get ready for. Six months ago, my husband and I picked up our whole lives and moved to a totally new to us part of the state. San Diego, California. No friends in this new town, no church to call home, just a job and a dream. And that dream was to build this garden. If you haven't seen my Tell Me Your Dreams video, I'll link it above and down below. And the goal in building this garden has been to learn to homestead in the suburbs stewarding what we've been given now in hopes for a healing farm in the future. With a little help from Tommy and a lot of creativity, I built this garden. listening to my friends Josh de Yonker from the City Stead and Morgan Gold from Goldshaw Farm on their podcast well Morgan's podcast and Josh was a guest you can homestead wherever you are when you've got the right mindset What I just wondered is if hanging these chimes here and having them play their song makes my plants happy. <laughs> I feel like it does. It does, right? I think it does. And together we planted the garden. There's like no good, no good spot here. I did want to share with you guys what tool we're using today, and we're using this tool from Gardeners. It helps you space out your seeds, provides you with a little, what would you call this, a dowel? Yeah, so you can poke a hole in the ground. I use it a little more primitively. I like to just stir up the dirt to get a hole, because then it loosens it, a little compacted. What's the theory behind this? I don't know, there's no theory. It's just like the dirt was... So tight? Like packed. Compacted. Yeah. Normally you'd use it like this. All right, you'd space it and then bop it. <laughs> but. These are also some big seeds. So. What are you planting right now? These are peas, green beauty peas. I guess they are pretty or something. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Tommy's got his own system for using this thing. Makes sense to me, loosen up the soil, make room for some roots. With his help, we're almost done planting. We just planted like half of the fall garden bed, essentially. The cool weather crop, the microclimate bed is what I'm calling it. So it's looking really good, good job. Hey. Tommy has never been as interested in gardening as me. And at times that has been really hard, but I hope that this moment in this video, in this very special to me video, can encourage you to A, start your garden wherever you're at. If you're like me, if you're feeling how I was feeling a year and a half ago, super hopeless and super desperate to start gardening, but not knowing where to start and feeling very black and white with it, you know, feeling like you have to have this huge garden or this huge farm to get started, you don't. And I would encourage you, like, just start where you are with what you've got. And if you feel like you really need your partner to be okay with this or to do it with you, but they're kind of reluctant, go for it anyway. Work with them and see if you can't work out some kind of compromise to do your own things. Passion is in your heart for a reason. I firmly believe that 100%. This desire to garden is in your heart for a reason. Steward that well, steward that do something with that because it's there for a reason. And I hope, I hope that this video can serve as a little encouragement to you that my little flicker of a flame of a dream to garden has now turned into a 500 square foot garden in the suburbs. And I have a partner who's willing to come out and help me every now and again. See if they're not also affected by your passion too.
yeah, that's that's good for now. Thank you so much. It looks really good. All right, well, that was a lot of planting. I guess, it, is it time for a lunch break? <laughs> Tommy wants in and out. Hey, Ethan, what's up? Yeah, yes, that is a good question. Also, you know that that part is like, that part's a secret, right? Okay, okay, he's out. Yeah, I know, you're really good about that stuff. Okay, hang on one second. All right, thanks, bye. I'll tell you a secret. Party is actually a surprise party for Tommy. He knows that people are coming, but he doesn't know that it's for his birthday. It's a surprise party. After adding the final seeds, it was time for the surprise party, which was a party that Tommy knew about, but he didn't know it was for him. He has no idea. It's like 20 minutes till people start getting here. Hi, baby. Hi. You found me. You want to come in here, sunshine? Why don't you come in? Come here, boo-boo bear. I think I just need to do my hair, and then we're ready to go. Forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> I tried to be Whole30 compliant with this homemade hot dog bun out of sweet potato. Here's my Whole30 approved bun. Wow, look at that. Don't eat this, guys. This is my hot dog bun. Wow. Uh, Whole30 hot dog bun. Okay, not bad. I see you, Whole30. But mostly, I just tried to be present and soak in the beauty of this night. It was a glorious moment of so much hard work paying off. And then it was finally showtime. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Hey, tea for Tommy. Hey. 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 That's nice. Thank you. Yeah, I never had a birthday party. I know you it's did. A Surprise. Awesome. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Make sure to like and subscribe. <laughs> Are you ready for the mood lighting? The mood lighting. Wait, that's not it. <laughs> Wait for it. Little did you expect to have a birthday party in August. <laughs> I know. Wow. I am. Wow. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. What is it? Funky shoulder? Breckenridge Reserve Blend, a blend of straight bourbon whiskey. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> well, I didn't think that um, the first garden party would be of men drinking uh, aged whiskey, <laughs> but. That's, that's how it goes. That's, and we got him. That is the garden party. We got him. He didn't know. He had no idea it was coming. Thank you so much for watching and following along with our journey. Your presence here has meant so much and you reach out to me and you share with me how much these videos mean to you and what I can't express to you accurately is how much that means to me as a creator. To know that I'm making these videos and that they're not in vain and that they have a positive impact on your life, like that's, that's exactly why I'm doing this. It just brings my heart so much joy. So. Thank you so much for supporting me, for supporting Tommy and I on this journey as we venture into YouTube and share our lives with you, share our garden with you, share my expertise in mental health with you. Ultimately, I just hope to inspire people to get out in the garden, to live a natural life, and to live a life that they love.
I really think that a positive perspective can change so much in our lives and I hope to spread those positive vibes through this little corner of the internet and so I want to say a huge shout out to you guys especially if you made it this far in the video thanks for watching um, a couple things that you might be interested in <laughs> mom <laughs> To anybody who might be curious about how you can support this channel, you can support our channel by shopping through our Amazon storefront. When you go to Amazon through our link down below, you shop on Amazon and give us some credit. This helps support our journey and we can't thank you enough for your love and support in this way. You can also shop the products that we love, which I link down below in every show note. And it's wild to say, but with the encouragement of a friend, I finally did it. I finally set up an Amazon wish list and currently there's one thing on there. I just don't have the boldness to put all of these things that we want on there just yet. But we've put one thing on there. If you want to go check out what we have on our Amazon wish list, it is also linked down below. We've also got a blog, we've also got Instagram, we've also got a wellness Facebook group and a Facebook page. And all of these things are linked down below and I really want to highlight the wellness group to you guys if you guys are looking for practical tips on how you can live a better healthier more natural life using natural products using things from the garden this is going to be the group for you I'm going to be bringing guest speakers in each month to share with us their tips and tricks and share with you guys my expertise as a mental health professional as well so go 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 use the links connect with us on Facebook I'm so thankful to know you guys through this wonderful adventure. Thanks for being here and I'll see you guys in the next one. And if you want to join me live after this video, I'm going to go live. I hope to see you there. Bye.